Hello and welcome back to Pratfall. Today we're going to be doing something a little bit different. We're going to be attempting to make a tiered crop farm. I'm not entirely sure how it's going to turn out to be honest, but we'll find out together and hopefully it looks okay. So essentially we're going to take like three or four big platforms and ascend each one up slightly into a big sort of square. Um, with each level having a different kind of crop planted in it. Now, what is the purpose of this, you may ask? Well, let me tell you, there isn't one, to be fair. That there really isn't one. Hopefully it looks aesthetically pleasing, but apart from that, pfft, it's not going to be the biggest farm patch, so if you're looking to build a massive farm with everything you could possibly need in it, then this isn't going to be the video for you. But, yeah, maybe you have like a small village build and you just want a small patch, then this this could potentially work. It might look quite good, so let's get into it. So the plan here is to build the foundation for each level, then cut out a big square in each for the farm soil, and I may also add a nice little trim around the edge too. Uh, we're mostly going to be using palm wood because it looks fantastic. Or should I say farm wood because we're building a farm... Like, okay. So we've now finished building the basic structure using refined wood for the uh, trims around the edges. Now comes the fun part because we're going to chip away at the walls here and then incorporate some of the newly added flower pots. We'll be going for a different colour scheme on each level which will hopefully correspond with the types of crops that we end up planting. So, for some reason, the game currently is placing everything at a slight angle. You can see that the seed beds here, and the carpet, and the bench, there are, nothing's placing straight, and I don't understand why. Uh, maybe reloading the game will, will fix this? I don't know. Anyway, uh, aside from that, <laughs> we're all done with the build now, and um, I'm pretty happy with it overall, to be fair. So uh, I'll give you a quick tour of the whole thing. So we've crafted a couple of these um, hanging lanterns here. That's probably the most difficult thing for me to build, to be fair, because I had to collect uh, iron and glass for those, which is something that I hadn't really come across yet. But I do think 
they uh, they definitely match the aesthetic really well so i wanted to get those in there uh, and as i mentioned we have a different sort of color theme for each level so we have the violet indigo sort of base level here and um, we've got all the flower pots which is a lovely addition and I'm, I'm very happy they've added those to the game and then uh, on the walls there we have the firefly lamps which again i think they just match quite well they have that sort of natural aesthetic to them it's a very nice indeed and then up here we've got the sort of yellow slash white level I'm not describing this very well. I keep forgetting the names of the plants, to be honest with you. Ah, that's fine. Uh, I know what these are. These are strawberries. These are strawberries and the bell peppers too. Uh, and then on the top, we have some tall ass sugar canes and stuff like that. So yeah, I'm, I'm actually, I mentioned at the start, I wasn't sure how this was going to turn out, but I'm actually really pleased with it. Again, it doesn't serve much of a purpose, I suppose, but aesthetically, very pleased very pleased hopefully you can take some sort of inspiration from this um as is always the aim with these build videos if not if you don't like it you think it looks like shit then thank you for watching the video anyway we always appreciate it regardless as always guys consider subscribing to the channel for more content like this drop us a like to show your support comment any uh, suggestions you have for the future have fun out there and above all don't be a prat.